reason for the crutches is there is a reason. I promise you, it's not just an excuse to shoot my girlfriend through a bathroom door. No, 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 I wouldn't. I'm saying I'm not. No, I wouldn't. I'm saying I wouldn't do that. No, I, di I wouldn't. I can't. I wouldn't even. There's no. I don't even have a bathroom door. So. I suffer from a terrible disease called white guilt. Okay, you guys will know what I'm talking about. It attacks you from the inside out. It's horrible, okay? It's, and I, it, it, it's, it's, it's a difficult thing because I always feel like I'm, 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 I'm it's guilt, that's what it is. And I, it comes up whenever I'm around black people, I feel like I need to overcompensate. <laughs> like, I need to greet more. Hi, 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 hi. Fine, it doesn't matter. Are you good? Okay, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. <laughs> Because I was giving my my black friend, my friend, my my the, my friend the again. You see, I don't know my friend who's black, a black friend, my, Mzamo. His name's Mzamo. He's one of my best friends. He's black my, anyway. <laughs> I was giving him a lift in my jeep, and no, you see, now I can't, I have to say the type because he, as he got in, I started explaining myself started explaining how I got the car. I was like, I just want to tell you it's second hand. It's not new. I wouldn't, I don't have that. I mean, it's like, and I'm paying it off in monthly installments in Zamo, so I can't, I mean, like, I mean, my dad, I mean, this is, I don't just have like sort of white money just lying around that I can just, I promise you. And my dad had nothing to do with it except a 60,000 Rand deposit. No, that, 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 that. That's it. I mean, you could have this, you, you work as hard as, I mean, you should have the Jeep. You can ha have the Jeep. I gave him the Jeep. <laughs> Who now owns the Jeep? So, it comes up on you and it's like this guilty, you know, it's this guilty voice that comes up. I call him Jono. Wherever, whenever I'm around a black person, this voice comes, like I'll be at the spa, doing my groceries, at the check, I, say, I have to say spa because if I say Woolworths, then you're gonna judge me, so let's. <laughs> it's the spa for this joke. We know it's not the spa. <laughs> I'm at the check-in counter and the voice comes, he comes, but aren't you going to greet her? Aren't you going to greet the lady? Or are you just going to ignore her? Like you ignore the townships when you walk past them. What is she, Tembisa? I mean, she might be, but we don't know. I'm sorry, I'll greet her. Okay, hello. He's like, speak her fucking language. What are you just going to call her now? Are you going to colonize the counter now? Speaking the Queen's language. <laughs> Colin asked the cash register, guy fucking skydiving. <laughs> like, okay, I'll speak her Kunjani. How do you know she's Corsa? <laughs> she could be Venda, Tswana, the other ones. <laughs> So Jono has a way of bringing me down to earth, but he still confuses me because I don't know what, how, who I am in the country. Like I'm a South African, I'm a white South African, but I'm a South African nonetheless. But you know when you don't feel welcome in your own, not your land? <laughs> feel like you've overstayed your never were welcome here in the first place. I feel that way. And people do ask, the whole of 2018 I was asked for land. Every time, Twitter, give back the land, that was it. We will go, uh, guys, I've got no, I'm renting in Melville. I don't have land. But I want that land. That is good land. Can we please together go, I want to jump on that land wagon and go and get that. Because I'm done with white people. I just want to tell you guys right now. I'm finished. Look, the table, nothing. Water, you guys, pizza, onion rings, champagne. There's fuck all there. I'm here now. I'm here. This is what I want. Because <laughs> black people and Jewish people, same WhatsApp group, guys. I promise you. <laughs> We don't swim either, I promise you. We, no, we don't. We don't like it. 
You remember in the biblical days in the Old Testament when Moses parted the Red Sea? That was Jew. He was like, Futsak, we are not, we are walking here. 